my I goodness. You guys are liars. All of y'all, liars. You can record me all you want, dog. Like, it's not a big deal. Like, you can do what you do, bro. You can do what you do. But you see these kids, keep my name out of your mouth. Out of my mouth. Now, the title of the video is called Daycare Worker Goes Off on Kids for Telling About the Daycare Worker's Behavior. So, I'm assuming that these kids are expressing their concerns about one of the daycare workers at the daycare where these kids are at. Um, the, the behavior demonstrated by this worker. And this worker, who you see in the clip, <clears throat> I guess is assuming innocence and she's saying that the kids are lying well one i think it's highly unlikely that majority if not all of the kids are coming up with the exact same story that's outlining the behaviors of this daycare worker for one and then number two when usually when someone gets called out or there's an allegation you know against a person when you look at how they react to that allegation when you look at when you look at their behaviors demonstrated, you know, after they've been uh, uh, alleged of doing something they weren't supposed to be doing, whether it's at work, whether it's criminal or not, um, that's a good indicator whether the story is true or not. And just looking at this daycare worker's behavior, I mean, she's yelling at children, essentially arguing with children, talking about you're liars, you're all liars, keep my name out of your mouth. Those are uh, fighting words typically between two adults. So... I'm inclined to believe that the children may be onto something. I'm not sure about all the details and the video doesn't really detail like what happened, you know, specifically or what behaviors were demonstrated, but just looking at this daycare worker's behavior in this video, it's reasonable to assume that whatever she did, the worker that is, it probably was unprofessional and probably if the parents of these kids found out, the parents wouldn't be too happy about it. Keep your name, keep my name out of y'all mouths. That's what I'm saying because there are going to be consequences for you going and lying on me like this. And she now, what are those consequences? Are she is she is she saying that there's going to be consequences for the children for lying, or what? What she's a uh, alleging that their kids are lying? Are there going to be consequences for that, or are there going to be consequences for the allegations brought forward on the daycare workers' behavior? Where consequences could be uh, brought on the worker. I need clarification on that. She's over there smiling like it's funny. Smile, y'all. She's okay. smiling. She's smiling. She's smiling. She's smiling. She's smiling. She's smiling. She knows what she's doing. Another thing too is the person who's recording this video is, I'm assuming, someone who works at the daycare. So you have one adult escorting this individual out, this uh, daycare worker with bad behavior out. Then you have another daycare worker who's an adult recording this. So it's reasonable to assume that this daycare worker was doing something she wasn't supposed to be doing. And how many stories have we seen of, uh, or videos rather, of kids coming forward, parents coming to pick up their kids, I mean, with black eyes, scratches on their face, and the daycare has no explanation. They don't know what happened or they're making up something that doesn't really fit the evidence or the, the the damage to the kid's face, you know, or the damage to the kid's body. You know what I mean? I've seen plenty of stories like that. Kid comes home or a parent goes to pick up the kid, got bruises. The kid has bruises all on her back and things like that. And then the daycare says that, oh, well, the, the child fell or something like that, you know? So it's good that this this is being recorded and put out there. And I mean, for parents who have kids, um, you know, you have to really vet these daycares that you're, you know, dropping your kids off to because your kids are going to be there, I'm assuming, about eight hours a day. So, I mean, you, you need to know who, who's basically watching your kids for eight hours a day, you know, because sometimes people, they get frustrated. They may not like kids as much as they think they do. And they start to lash out. And then, they you know, children will be children. They do things. You know, they say things, you know, that may be considered inappropriate if an adult would say it. And I mean, if you don't have trained professionals there who know how to deal with children, you might have someone like this watching your kids. They know what that is. It's not funny. It's not funny. Keep my name out of your mouth. 
Well, that's the end of the video, guys. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section box below. Me personally, when I'm sitting my, if I when I get kids, when I send them to daycare, I'm looking at the first thing is reviews. Whatever daycare that I see, I'm looking at Google reviews, see how many people reviewed, and then if it's a if it's a 4.5 star or up uh, or organization. I don't do two, I don't do three star, two star, you know, because you might have people like this in the video, right? This daycare worker that I showed you guys in the clip, you might have someone like that who is working, and you don't know if your kid is gonna catch them on a bad day. And I mean, what parent wants to go pick up their kid and find out that you know their daycare worker says something to the child that they weren't supposed to say? or the child has scratches and bruises what parent wants to go through that so it's much better to just vet these daycares look at the reviews look what other parents experiences were with working with these daycares um, because these daycares are charging a lot of money and i'm assuming because of inflation now throughout the country they're charging even more money you know what i mean probably 600 700 a month for just one kid so you know that's just something to think about but let me know what you guys think in the comment section box below i could be wrong about this i don't think i am like this video share this video subscribe to my channel for more content links to instagram and facebook will be in the description box below i'm out